Hey guys, welcome to my channel and thank you for joining me today. Today we're gonna talk about the most hyped NFT projects on Solana Network. And before we dive in, I just want to say that I'm not a financial advisor, I'm just here to share my own opinion on different NFTs, JPEGs and stuff like that. And the first project of course is Zayson Raptors. This project was so hyped, oh my god, like I've seen it everywhere and it was almost impossible to mint them. The whitelist was closed, Discord was closed, the floor price right now is 37 sol. As soon as the mint was over, their prices were starting at 26 sol floor price and now currently they're being traded above 37 sol. So the team of this project, in my opinion, they did an amazing job when it comes to marketing and development of this project. They definitely made and created a lot of hype around it and it was so, so hard to get into the whitelist and I wish I could, but unfortunately I didn't make it there. Right now they have only 144 listed. It was a little bit higher when I checked like an hour ago out of the collection of 1,555 Raptors. It's only less than like 10% listed currently, which is quite good because honestly, right after the mint, most people start like dumping their new mints, etc. Maybe they got disappointed with their with whatever NFT they have minted. So it's quite usual, but not with this project because the floor price is so high for such a new project. And I think it kind of justifies by the fact that there was so much hype and it was very, very hard to get into the mint. It felt very exclusive for people to get into this project. That's why they're still holding it. And long term, I think it can go even higher, but who knows? It all depends on the community and the team. Whatever they're going to deliver within the next couple of weeks will kind of show and indicate the route that this project is going to take. But I feel quite optimistic about this one, even though I feel that the price can go slightly lower just because of the people that are listing on the secondary market right after the mint. That's just the usual practice in the Solana space. So I'll be just looking at this project and if the floor dips a little lower, I'll see if I can grab one of these. Probably not at the price of like 35 sol. Maybe if it's around 20 sol, I'll grab one of these. Right now it seems kind of impossible to go that low, but who knows, maybe it will go down a little bit for a short period of time, but I'm sure there will be a lot of people to buy at that price around 20 sol. So I don't think it's gonna dip for a long time, if it ever will. Maybe it's just gonna go up from here to 100, who knows. So this looks really, really hyped. I'm very excited to see what they're gonna bring to this space overall. I'm not sure how much the price will go up or if it's gonna stay the same or it's just gonna skyrocket from here because they just minted yesterday. So I'm very curious to see how this all gonna work out. But so far it looks really, really good. Their volume is just ridiculous for a new project and the activity is quite high to be honest for such a floor price. I think it's a great, great project to look into. Currently there are a lot of whales holding this project so I don't think this project is gonna go down a lot for any unknown reason. I think this project has more potential to come and with all the funds that the team got from the Mint, I'm very curious to see what they have to offer and what they actually gonna deliver and how fast it's gonna take them to deliver. I'm personally gonna be looking to buy into this project but again, all depends on the floor price and overall execution of the project. If this project is within your budget, so I definitely recommend you to study it, look into it and decide for yourself if you wanna buy it or not. I can definitely see how all the funds and all the hype can be used to make it one of the top Solana NFT projects very, very soon. Next project that is absolutely hyped right now is D Gods, currently sitting at the floor price around 80 sol. If we go here and look at the graphs, we will see that within the last months, the floor price was around 30, 40 sol and then it just skyrocketed basically up to almost 90 sol and I personally was checking their sales and activity and people were buying these NFTs around 100 sol and above. If you are in the Solana space for a little bit, you know about D-Gods, you know about them, you know about their community but if you're new here then of course check it out if you can afford it look into it. I personally would see how they can correct their floor price and go down 
slightly more from from their 90 soul now they're at 80 i could see it being around 60 depending on their tokenomics as well because they have staking protocol which people are very very happy about and that's why people are holding multiple of these more than just one d god in their wallet in their staking and the community is so strong because the team is delivering so much for their holders they have so much going on they have such a strong community everybody knows about them the marketing is amazing they have staking they have merch they have so many things going on there is so much more like that they trying to bring to the community i think from a business perspective they're doing the great job because when people pay for something they expect certain return but if they get even more than what they expect that's what makes them really happy and i think that's the example of d gods where people invested some money in the floor price was around eight soul like a month or two i think not one month but like a couple months ago it was around eight soul recently and right now it's almost like 10x for the investors and people are very happy and they don't want to just sell it because there is so much that the team is giving to the community so people would want to be and remain into that in that community instead of just leaving it for even 10x profit so imagine how good is the community and how good is the development team behind it so when it comes to the price right now i think 80 soul is a decent price compared to the all-time high of 90 and above but again i personally believe it might go a little bit lower and that might be a better time to invest into this project and to see even bigger gains overall long term and last project for today that i want to cover is famous fox federation I think it's a great project, the art is super cute, the floor price is around 17 sol. If we go to Solwatch and check their analytics on their floor price, we'll see that they've been sitting around 10 Solana floor price for quite a while, but right now they're trading way above 16, 15 floor. And if you haven't heard about this project for some reason, I would tell you that they're doing a great job when it comes to marketing and the community. That's why they're able to drive so many more investors into their project, boosting their floor price to 17 sol just from a couple weeks ago when it was 10 sol, right? And if you look at the art itself, it's very clean, very nice, very cute. If you like something like that, then definitely it's going to be something that you will enjoy as your profile picture. But along with that, they have staking that is not just staking for the sake of staking, where liquidity pool will be drained out anytime, any day, you know, and there is no utility. Of course, it's not the case here. Here, we have the website, we have the platform, we have so much more that they're doing and building, and so much that they have already delivered here. You can go to the website and you can see how much they have done so far and how much they have built and delivered to their holders and to the Solana community in general, you know, because even if you're not the holder of Famous Fox Federation, you can always come and use their platform to trade whitelist tokens, to use any of other services that they have. You know, I think it's very, very good for the community for the Solana community in general and I think it's even better for the holders of this project because it gives so much more stability and security when it comes to investing into this project because if you decide to invest in this project you understand what stands behind the tokenomics what developers are working on what kind of value they're bringing what they're doing they're not just giving out money to bring more money you know they're not trying to create some kind of weird Ponzi scheme to get more money than to put it in a, into a liquidity pool and then people can stake it you know that's not the case here here people are actually working on building something really cool long term and I think that's why they're getting so much traction these days I think this project is one of these projects that are gonna last for a long time it's gonna survive and they're gonna bring so much more value and because of that the floor price and the value of the project will go even higher because they're not here to make a quick buck and then disappear after a couple of months. They're here to build. They're here to bring value to the Solana community, to make something new, to give something to the space that people are lacking. And people are using every single day for different mints and different other occasions as well. I'm not sure what's going to happen with the price short term, if it's going to correct a little bit and it's going to be a better point of entry or if we're going to wake up tomorrow and it's going to be 20 sol price, who knows. To summarize, I think it's one of the few projects in the Solana ecosystem that has 
very very solid service or product that they're currently delivering that is being highly demanded and it's not just used by their own community it's just used within the whole Solana ecosystem people are using their services all the time when it comes to minting when it comes to other things related to NFTs the way they have been delivering so far if they're gonna just keep going in the same pace I think we're gonna see amazing floor prices in a very near future and I think this project is very very solid for long-term and short-term investment as well that's it for today's video guys really hope you liked it drop a like and subscribe to my channel if you haven't it really helps me and helps YouTube algorithm to push my videos even higher and for more people to see it so I hope you have a wonderful day and I'll see you in the next one